In the interest of full disclosure, I tried to be nice the last time and people got pissed off anyway, so the logical thing to do is to pull out my stick and start poking them again. Wait. Thunder, I'm every single drop of rain, I'm the hunger, I'm every single ounce of pain, I'm the tides, salt water, ocean, far and wide, I'm hard to find. The last time we did this, most of the debate was semantics, and admittedly some definitions of sport would include golf, but it continues to be my opinion that golf is a game of skill and not a sport. And the fact remains that golf does not require athleticism, and most golfers are not athletes. There are 80 year old, 400 pound men that are good at golf. That's proof enough that golf does not require athleticism. Even the poster boy for athletic golfer cannot play any major professional sport. He couldn't make a Division I baseball, basketball, football, or track team. While we're on that subject, Tiger Woods, that guy that thousands of you golfers have an inexplicable and disturbing non-sexual man crush on, is a loser. You know, I'm not even talking about the low-rent slut marathon that he's always starring in or all the things that the media seems to focus on. It's the fact that he's such a crybaby and everything is always somebody else's fault. When he hits it too far, he fires his caddy. When he doesn't hit it far enough, he tells Nike to make him some new clubs. When he just sucks, it must be a swing coach. And heaven forbid that somebody snap a picture or make a noise when he's trying to hit a shot. Michael Jordan, Derek Jeter, or Brett Favre never had to deal with anything like that. See, he demands perfect silence and the optimum favorable environment so he can succeed. Now, I'm sure there are people who are going to say, you're just jealous because he's successful and he's a millionaire. But you're wrong. You're wrong because I firmly believe something I once read. You're not your job. You're not how much money you have in the bank. You're not the car you drive. You're not the contents of your wallet. You're not your fucking khakis. What we are is what we leave behind in the hearts and minds of people that matter to us. And while your pants might be nicer than mine, you're losing at life. Thanks for watching. If you agree or disagree, post a comment or video response down there. Like. Favorite. Share. Remember to subscribe for the latest videos so I don't have to. Cross you with my mind.